Good morning everyone, it's Saturday morning, I've just arrived at V Fitness in Abercannon and I'm meeting the lovely Emily Hooper for a circuit session, so here it goes. <laughs> So, so here we are guys, just come out of the workout session with Emily at V Fitness in Abercannon and I am absolutely shattered. The workout was absolutely amazing, really really tough but um, we got through it. Some of the exercises I couldn't do but I did my best and that's all we can do isn't it? Um, what's been happening this week? Well, um, I started off with a bit of a rubbish week put on two and a half pound um tuesday then was feeling a bit uh, and couldn't just snap out of my miserable mood but um obviously i posted a blog and people came on and gave their support and encouragement and um i was back on it so being really really focused really really driven um and i'm feeling positive again so hopefully this week we'll have a good loss so I'm off home now and I'm going to make a chicken jambalaya. So why don't you all follow me and I'll show you how it goes. So here we are guys in my kitchen ready to make our chicken jambalaya. So here it goes. Let me just show you what ingredients we have. Oh sorry, I mentioned on a banana. Here it goes. So here we have one large chopped onion. Um, we have 60 grams of sun-dried tomato. We have some garlic paste, or you can use free cloves. We've got some mixed herbs. We've got some fennel, and we've got some chicken stock. In addition to that, we've got 500 grams of chicken, some mixed peppers, 300 grams of brown rice, and a tin of tomatoes. So let's put it all together. So here yeah, guys, you can see in a pan, I've added some olive oil, I've added the onions, the garlic, the mixed peppers, and the fennel seeds. So we're just gonna leave that simmer, or just cook gently for five minutes. So once the chicken is cooked, you just need to add the rest of the ingredients. So the chopped tomatoes, you need to add your brown rice, which we'll get now. This rice, guys, I've already measured out, so um, don't worry about that. A pinch of black salt. The sun-dried tomatoes. And then 700 mils of stock. The 
the idea is then guys you give that a good mix in and then you turn the pot down low and you just need to then leave simmer for 30 to 40 minutes until the rice cooked is cooked through and then you just get to enjoy so fingers crossed So we'll just leave that sit now for 40 minutes and come back and see what it's like. So there you go guys, after 35 minutes of just simmering gently, all the liquid has reduced and you're left with your chicken and rice. Now time to put in a bowl and see how it tastes. And there you have it guys, one bowl of chicken jambalaya.